Good afternoon, everyone. Today is day three in Connecticut. It's the third CT vlog. And the Rice from Yacht is already on our favorite thing in the world, Anton's trailer. I almost just tripped and almost broke my ankle already, but we're bringing the Rice from Yacht back to my mom's house. All of my tools are there. Thank Christ I brought my tools from Florida to Connecticut because I would have been screwed. I've already used them like literally every single day I've been here. So tools, they are very important. And I think this thing jumped timing, man. I mean, it's the only thing that makes sense in my head. We ordered just the crappiest of the crappiest stuff we can get because that's the only thing that you can get like one night or same day, so. Let's go to my mom's house and fix this piece. Anton's off, Grillo's off. Today's gonna be a good day. Let's hit it. All right, so I just got to my mom's house. I immediately pulled into the, pulled into the driveway and started to work. And I was taking the valve cover off. And as I was taking the valve cover off, I noticed that the cam angle was like a little unplugged. It was like kind of like, it looked broken. It was angled back. And Anton was like, you think that's it? And I'm like, I guess we'll try it. So I put the valve cover back on, I plugged it in and. Sounds meant to me. Sounds pretty good. You wanna go for a rip? Hell yeah. It's only at 17 PSI. Only. So this is what your Miata could have done, but your dad bought it out. <laughs> I love how I'm making fun of him, I'm more fat than him. That's the best part. <laughs> All right, so I guess that was the only thing wrong with it. Thank God I saw that because I was literally about to take the whole engine apart, but I guess we should celebrate. I want to give this burnout to Octavio from Treasure Coast because he's the reason technically why I'm here right now because, I mean, I was never going to check timing. He told me to check timing and that was the problem. So I fixed it and here you go, Octavio, for you. <laughs> sensor I think it's like so close to being connected and it's like connecting disconnecting connecting disconnecting like super fast you can see it just spazzing out and you can hear it sick brother all right so we probably have been coasting not even exaggerating two miles and we're gonna try to make it into the driveway right now hopefully there's no cars I'm just gonna try to go go for it dude. go 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 oh look <laughs> go we're coming in high boy ah! Right up to this oh. fucking box, dude. dude. <laughs> right back in the same spot. Literally, we're stuck. Oh, we're not stuck, but we were almost. Um, let's fix it. <laughs> All right, so we just got the star right now. So last time Anton rode this, how fast did you go? Like 40, 40? 45. This ago is about 75 miles. <laughs> That's sick. And if you floor it from the jump. Wheelie. The, yeah, no, lean forward. Because <laughs> it will literally just snap back. Okay. So, I'll go for a little rip first. I hit 40 by that telephone pole. 40? <laughs> oh my god, dude, I'm um, nervous. EP is sport now. Yeah. And this brake doesn't work. This is completely useless. Only front brake works. It's a neutral. Yeah. <laughs> She's pretty quick. <laughs> Turns his hat around. For electric, what do you think? Only the front brake works. This is a death trap. <laughs> For electric, what do you think? It's crazy. It's fast. Dude. It's fun. 
<laughs> Imagine yeah, this thing in the woods. Yeah. What do you think about this thing in the woods, though? It'd be, sick. It'd be gnar. I gotta get a back break before I do that. Yeah, it's bad. Because if you freaking hit them in the um, dirt, you're just done. You're dumping this thing. Or even if you gotta slow down quick, you're done. Well, don't have to slow down quick. Use yeah. your feet. Yeah, like it's, no one will pull No, it's like me. BMX. You just put your feet down. <laughs> yeah, 70 miles an hour. <laughs> so a couple times now, I posted about my brodozer and everything, and Anton would comment on my pictures and like kind of talk, how do, I can't swear, talk crap about my truck. What is this pile of dookie? Pile of dookie? <laughs> pile of dookie? Yeah, what is it? Sir. <laughs> this right here is a race truck. It's a race truck. Race truck. Dump tons of soot. Careful. <laughs> wait, wait, what do you call it? Do you call it soot here? It's soot. It's soot. soot. I say soot on my videos and people make fun of me. But I guess it's really, it's different everywhere. Like Connecticut, like, you know. It's soot. Every, everywhere says things differently. Yeah, everyone says we should say roll coal, but sooting sounds cooler. No, we, we use it like in like, uh, like, uh, I don't know how to explain it because I was bad at English, but like a, <laughs> like a past tense, like I rolled coal on somebody. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That makes sense. But like right now, like, I mean, you could say I'm rolling coal, but yeah. like the black stuff that physically comes out, we it's call soot. soot. Like a train, they soot, like, train soot. Yes, exactly. So anyways, this is- Do you know what is, soot is? It's the black stuff that comes out of your exhaust. Yeah, but do you know why it's black? Cause it's all unburnt fuel. Okay, I was gonna make you try to sound dumb, but. <laughs> nice try, nice spit too. Thank anyways, you. what year is this pig? This is 2012. 2012, so it's got the better turbo? Yeah. But these blow up faster, the turbos, right? The main bearings go on these. Yeah, but... 2011 was bad for the turbos. But, th if, correct me if I'm wrong, you can make more power on the early model turbos rather than my new one. Yes. Okay. So, um, it's a 2012. As you can see, it's got some damn... I mean, <laughs> I have no payments on this truck. If you want True. to compare prices... True. I won't have any payments by the end of the month, though. Yeah, but I didn't have hey. total. <laughs> and I paid a lot less money. Talk to Andy. This is my cousin. Uh, What's up, dude? Uh, nice mask, brother. All right, anyway, so you don't have payments. You got some dings. You got some dents. But it's a work rig. But it, oh, I thought it was a racetrack. But it's both. <laughs> that's, that's the benefit, dude. It's a, two, it's a tour. I will say, I am jealous that you saw it. Are you jealous of these? Ooh, you got bags? And I have a built-in air compressor. Dang. The fucking band blew off it. Yeah, I was about to say, it's a little rough around the edges. That's sick, though. So, like, you can put my trailer on your truck, and it won't sag at all. Oh, boy, he's about to flex on me. Can you hear it? I can, yeah. It's quiet. Yeah. So, basically, I just have a compressor. I can let air in and out of the bags. Dang, that's sick. Can you like dump it like Callie Lean? No. no. <laughs> oh, okay. That's a blur for sure. <laughs> but um, yeah, I guess let's let's see what. The, oh, he's got a flex. Oh, they're gonna here start it up. Sounds just like my truck. Oh. <laughs> All right, let's go for a rip. Now, if you want to share this with the world, you can. If not, it's cool. How much did you get this rig for? Nine grand. Nine grand? How many miles are on this puppy? I bought it with 207. Okay. And it's got 220 on it, 221 on it. It now. sounds sick. I must say. Five inch turbo back, baby. So is that the reason? I, I wonder what I have. I don't even know. Oh. <laughs> All right, you're going to kill us, <laughs> too. She's a so monster, huh? I told you. <laughs> Dude. Was that is this, this this is my second tune. Oh, I was just about to ask my that. My next tune makes a hundred more horsepower. It makes a hundred more. My second tune right now is your top tune, because I have custom tunes. How do you know that? Because I have custom tunes. I had original tunes and I sent this tune around. I don't know, man. I still think I can take the gold. Okay. I felt that it wasn't it's dollars. quick. Thousand <laughs> I want a friendly bat. I'll put I'll put my I'll put it all the way up. I'm gonna raise you on my second thing because I don't want to break anything, but if we're gonna bet a thousand dollars, I will turn this bitch all the way up. <laughs> <laughs> well, I don't think I want to bet any money, but we're definitely gonna have some races because Marcus has a 6-0 and that's like fully built and everything. Listen, Marcus. Oh boy. 6-0s are not the best. Oh, listen to this guy. First of all, 
I, I watched your video, I almost puked. What do you mean almost puked? Marcus is like, oh, six O's, you can make the fastest. Bullshit. Oh, you listen to the truck guy over Bullshit. here. Bullshit. <laughs> Bullshit. That's why I'm, I don't even want to get into it. But isn't seven threes the slowest? Uh, that's accurate. Yes. I mean, they're not like my seven three was pretty quick. Yeah, it was. For a seven three, it was quick. Yeah. But they're reliable. Yeah. Well, I mean, what? Do, I mean, other than the six O, what six isn't? Six fours are quick as fuck if you make them. No, I said like what isn't unreliable other than a six O. Six fours. Oh, are they? Junk. Really? They're worse than the six O's. I feel like you're really starting up battles right now in the comments. Well, let them. Let. Them. <laughs> so you know you're right. Straight facts. <laughs> you're spinning out faster. Straight facts. <laughs> oh boy. Well, anyways, um, let's go. Wait, let's go get Grillo. Cause he's ignoring my calls. Let's get him. Heck yeah. All right, so Grillo's in his deathbed of the week. Um, he just doesn't feel well, so he's not gonna come out. But dude, I, I, I didn't want to tell you. I wanted to tell you in person. Grillo has been making new songs. He, you know, he actually texted me. He texted you. And was like, hey, do you want to hear my new song? <laughs> like, what, late at night, you know, yeah. I got up at like four and I texted yeah. him back. And I'm like, yeah, sure, like, well, let's hear it. And, uh, <laughs> what? That was it? Yeah. So you haven't heard it? No, he just didn't respond. That's good because I don't want you to hear it. He, probably because he asked me. I told I told him not to tell you. Um, yeah, because I we're we're doing another music video. Oh God. We're, I would love to do it in the same place and everything. I think it would be good, dude. You don't he, have the Forester anymore. True. Well, we can total another car. That's not hard. We're good at that. You're not. <laughs> but he's coming out with two songs. I'll give you one hit. It's R. Kelly. It's R. Kelly songs. Ignition? No, no, no. It's his own songs. Oh, wow. But, like, he's inspired by R. Kelly. So, you already know. It's not about penises. It's, like, I will say this. For Grillo, it's it's a song. Yeah? Like, I, I, I um, let Courtney listen to it. She's like, I love it. And she hated the penis song. I mean, I don't think anybody really liked <laughs> the penis song. Like, I think Grillo's got another one-hit wonder, for sure. I think he, he'll be pulling in some bread with this. Yeah? Yeah, for sure. It's gonna be for sale, but once Grillo gets rid of whatever the hell's wrong this week, we're gonna... I finally got rid of the Buick. Did you? Yeah, fucking transmission smoked. <laughs> we were supposed to put gas in the engine. Yeah. My mom made me too scared. Smoked. Yeah. Well... All right, we are, I guess we're gonna go back to the house because poor Grillo is dizzy. <sighs> All right guys, so I didn't want to tell you in this video, but I bought a house. I bought a house in Connecticut and Anton just brought it to me and it's it's better than I could have imagined. What, what, what is that in your head? A G-U-N? An Airsoft. Yeah. That's an Airsoft. <laughs> Dude, I like my new house. Can I, can I go in it? Yeah. Is it locked? Yeah, it's been sitting, no, it's been, it's been sitting a while, but... Oh, boy. Yeah, it smells fantastic in here, dude. Oh, God. It's actually not that bad. Like, it's a little outdated. Oh, God! Yes! That is AIDS, dude. Dang, this ain't bad. I could start a family in here. I can't show that. We'll, we'll be back a little later. No, no. All right, so I just wanted to give a little sneak peek of what my mom's been doing for the past week. This is a 12-hour cake. Come on. What? I don't want to be on camera. You're, you're on camera right now. You got anything to say to the world? Um, Care about your kids. That's right. Care about your kids. Care about your kids. My mom does a lot for... She, she used to do a lot for me, but now it's all about Cooper. And she realized you were a loser. <laughs> But this is my favorite part of the party right here. Hey, this area over here. This area? What do you want to show? It's your birthday, dude. You got anything you want to say? I'm happy it's my birthday. I'm going <laughs> to turn nine. Nine? You probably are. No, you already are nine. I know. What are you playing? Death match? Cage match? Yeah. I don't really know much about wrestling. I'm going to show the rest of Mama's stuff after this guy gets on my way. Dude, I like that. The new six pack. You like that? <laughs> the dad butcher? Yeah, That's fire. But we got sandwiches, strawberries. Goldfish. Dang, this is this is banging. My mom's how long did you spend on the Undertaker? Not too long. Not too long? 
She made a real life okay. Undertaker, yeah. It's not a bad guy. She got a fog machine and everything. She's a good mom. All right, guys, so that was the end of today. Honestly, Cooper's party for a nine-year-old's birthday party, it was a lot of fun. Me, Anton, Andrew, and Cooper, we hung out. Cooper had a friend there. He had a bounce house. We had a um, pinata. It was really good. My mom is awesome when it comes to planning birthday parties like that. And uh, to be honest, overall, she's just a great mom, and I'm very lucky to have her, and Cooper is as well. But anyways, guys, I think we're going to end the video right here. I'm really happy that the Rice Miata was an easy fix. To be honest, I didn't even need a trailer. I guess if I just looked in the engine, Bay and kind of looked around for a few minutes I would have saw that it was kind of unplugged a little and like the clip was broken but I mean it felt like it would jump timing and honestly like every time like something breaks on the car it's never easy so I kind of just assumed that it was the timing which is kind of stupid but now I have a brand new um timing bell intentioner stuff Duralast the Duralast special but I guess we can save that because I'm sure um timing's gonna break on some car I'm gonna need to time a Miata someday but anyways guys I'm gonna end the video right here if you guys like this video give it a thumbs up if you guys want to subscribe for more subscribe for more a couple people have been asking about Chester <gasps> He's already waving. Look at this guy. He's right here. Chester didn't go anywhere. Chester, look how happy he is. This dog is the happiest dog on the planet, I swear. But anyways, we're going to end it on this note. I will see you guys tomorrow and subscribe for more.